Welcome to the project. In this video, my work is project title is the classification. In a world saturated with an astonishing array of simple zeros, let's find the elements of audio processing with the power of deep learning. Our project aspires to develop an innovative system that can upgrade the categorizing system in instant zero. Transcending the limit of human perception, the leveraging of CNN, they are rewarded for their volumes and image analysis. We extend the capability to audio and revealing the intricate patterns that define the each genome sonic signature. This project holds the event project not only enhancing the music voice exploration but also evaluation the way we organize. We recommend and create the music. And the primary objective of our project is to revolutionize the streamer identification and the audio. By extracting the intricate audio feature, we can create a robust system capable of accurately categorizing the diverse procedure. Through the integration of deep learning techniques, we seek to enhance the precision of general classification, enabling the music enthusiastic to explore and enjoy the personalized experience. Our goal is to establish an advanced music classification framework that not only improves the general recognition but also contributes to the broader field of audio analysis, facilitating the innovative application in the music recommendation, content organization, and artistic exploration. And these are the basic requirements that are needed to build this project. Software requirements are Python IDEL with version of 3.7, Anaconda with version of 3.7, and Pictel Notebook. Hardware requirements are operating system as Windows, processor of minimum Intel i3 and above, RAM of minimum 4GB, hard disk of minimum 3GB. And to know about the project, the project is a project we need to explain. The first one is importing the library. In this, we need to import the essential Python libraries, include TensorFlow, Keras, NumPy, and Class to facilitate the audio processing, deep learning, data manipulation, and web application development. And the second one is importing the dataset. Collecting an extensive dataset containing a body of files of diverse music genres is labeled with the corresponding general class. Ensure the proper organization of the dataset, the labels of dataset for the each genre. And the next one is data visualization. Visualize the audio waveforms or the spectrograms of the simple audio file to gain the insight into the characteristics and the variation of the different music genres. And the next step is printing into the training and the testing. Divide the data set into the training and the testing set, ensuring the model performance is evaluated on unseen data during the testing. And the next step is blending the model. CNN stands for Convolutional Neural Network is designed to specialize in CNN architecture for the audio analysis, accurate to the unique characteristics of the music data. This architecture incorporates a sequence of convolutional layers adapted to detecting the intricate pattern and subtle variation within the audio signal. Cooling layers are strategically positioned to facilitate the spatial down sampling, enabling the network to capture the hierarchical audio feature at the variant scale, and fully connected layers permeate the network utilizing the extracted features to make the general prediction. Architectural decisions and compose the capable selection of the channel size which dictate the receptive field for the feature extraction while activation functions such as reload and reduce the non-linear key amplifying the modal expressive capabilities. The CNN applicates to hierarchically analyze the audio spectra imparts and with a profound understanding of the distinctive timbral and the rhythmic aspects of inherent to different music genres. And the next step is training the model. The CNN model is used to training the data set, allowing to learn the discriminative features that differentiate the various music genres. During the training, the model optimizes its way through the back propagation and the gradient descent to minimize the classification loss. And the next one is user gives the input. Create a web application using the class, a Python web framework, enabling the user to upload the audio file for the gainer classification. 
and the next one is the given given input is pre-processed for prediction. The pre-processed user profile audio input match the format used during the model training, including the audio signal processing and the transformation. And the next step is the model train model is used for the prediction. Utilize the pre-processed audio input to make the prediction using the train model. CNN for the general classification. The model assigns a probability distribution over the different music genres, indicating the most likely genre. And the next one is final outcome as displaying. Displaying the prediction outcome presenting the predicted genre. The user gains the insight to the model classification, allowing for the informed undertake of the music genre based on the AI driver analysis and the execution of the project. To execute the project first, we need to open the code folder. And this is the code folder containing of various files within it. The static folder containing of CSS, images, JavaScript, web font, folders within it. And the notebook folder containing of the IPYNP file and the PY file, which likely contain the information related to the front-end logic and the combination of the code that is in the form of images and the output within it and it also make the file of making of using and writing the code in the individual cell making it a popular choice for the data science and the template folder containing of html documents like of about index result sign in and sign up pages within it and these are all the files and this is an after py file which likely contain the information related to the printing logic and it is loaded into the project of within the written in python that handle the server side operation such as processing the user request interacting with the database and generating the dynamic content that to be rendered in the html template and the model is an hpy file which likely contain the information of algorithm and loaded into the project code during the runtime to utilize the trial model for the various tasks such as making the prediction on the new data performing the specific operation and the signup.db is an file appear to be the database file used to store the user information and sample is an file that will be used for the class test performance of the model and for the execution of the project first, we need to copy this code folder path and then open the Anaconda prompt. Here we need to write a command that is cd space and paste this code folder path. By this it will change the current directory to the code folder path. And then click on the enter button. Here we need to write a command that is python space app.py. By using this command, it will execute the python script and perform the runtime check for any syntax errors or the logical issues. After clicking on the enter button, the app.py file will run and the Flask framework will force the application locally at the default address. Lion. Like this, we need to copy this link and paste it on any of the web browser of our choice and I prefer to use the Google Chrome. I am pasting this link and clicking on the enter button. Here it will redirect it to this page containing of the title of the project and some of the information about it. And click on the sign up button. Here it will redirect it to the sign up page containing of some necessary details that are need to be filled to create an account. But my account is already created that's why I am using the sign in button. Here it will redirect it to the sign in page containing of the username and password that are need to be filled to log in within the page. And I am clicking on the sign in button. Here it will redirect it to the index file containing of home, about and sign out buttons and the choose file and the predict button. Here click on the choose file button. Here it will redirect it to this folder and we need to select the sample folder and then click on the open button and then click on the predict button. Here it will redirect it to this result page and the given song is projected to be in the reggae genre. And this way we can classify the music genre by using the deep learning. And in the conclusion, our project on music classification harnessing the CNN marks a significant stride in the music analysis and the organization.
by leveraging the power of deep learning we have successfully demonstrated the potential of to categorize the music into the genres with the highest end accuracy this achievement not only enhances the music enthusiast's exploration but also lays the foundation for the advanced application and the content recommendation and the artistic discovery as we conclude this project we envision a harmonious future where ai driven music classification shapes the way we interact with and appreciate the diverse world of musical compositions enriching our auditory experience and redefining the music discovery thank you for watching video for more projects please visit our website www.trueprojects.in for updates on latest project videos, please visit True Projects YouTube channel and subscribe.